Welcome back to the channel. I hope everybody watching is having a great day. Today we're back with another episode of One Minute Sneaker Reviews. <laughs> this is where I give you a quick review of a shoe that I picked up in under one minute. I'll put a link to my last episode up on the screen right here if you want to go and check it out. Make sure you also check out my Instagram if you want to see any of my shoe posts before anybody else does. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. Alright, let's go. Let's go. Today we're taking a look at what might be Kanye's worst piece of footwear he's ever created. To start out, these stupid things were $225 after tax, and this man can't even send them to you in a shipping box. This is how it came in the mail. These shoes were released on December 15th, 2023, and I just got them today, February 7th, 2024. They come in three sizes, one, two, and three. Size one is three to six, two is seven to nine and a half, and three is 10 to 13. When you open up your USPS shipping bag, as if you just ordered an item from a Shopify startup, you'll see a nice silk dust bag, and inside are your socks, or shoes, or whatever you qualify these as. The Yeezy Pod debuts Kanye's first footwear model following his departure from Adidas. The minimalistic slip-on features a seamless one-piece crafted from knit black textile and stripped of any exterior branding. A stretchy collar extends to the mid-calf. As far as resale, surprisingly, these are selling better than most Yeezys right now. So it's gonna be really low, bro. I'll be honest, just the Yeezy market, it's like we're paying under retail for all of them. Yeah. But for Sizes are selling between $275 and $350, so hopefully I'll get my money back. I do not want these at all. This is a message to Kanye West. Please do better. Well, this has been One Minute Sneaker Reviews. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you for all of your support, and have a great day.